How did Darth Vader sleep? One mystery that many wonder is if Darth Vader was able to sleep, and if so, how would he even be able to do that? Well, let's just say it was a lot more difficult for him than you may think. Let's get right into it. After Vader was burnt on Mustafar, he suffered many injuries that restricted him from living a normal human life. In yesterday's video, we covered how difficult it was for him to eat, but this wasn't the only thing. Sleeping was actually one of the most challenging things for him to be able to do. When he was brought to Coruscant to have surgery for his new suit, Darth Sidious took advantage of this. He created Vader's suit to be a life support system, which would make Vader need to wear the suit at all times if he wanted to live. Without it, he would basically die. Not only this, but Sidious would make sure of two things that would happen to the suit. The first was that he set certain limitations in case Vader would ever try to turn against him. He basically made the suit extremely weak in some areas, for example, Force Lightning. Sidious created it so that Vader's suit would be extremely vulnerable to Force Lightning. He did this to always have control over him. The second was that he purposely created the suit to be as painful as possible for Vader. Sidious wanted him to be in a constant pain 24-7 so that he could end up having a stronger connection to the dark side. Vader would experience pain because his suit would require him to have needles injected all throughout his body. The reason for this is because the needles would send data in order for the life support system to work. Now let me ask you something. Have you ever noticed this control box in the middle of Vader's suit? Well, that's actually where the data would be sent. These needles would transfer the data to the control box and all these pieces would work together in order to keep him alive. Now the thing is, it's one thing to have needles injected into your skin, but Vader's case was a little bit different. After his injuries on Mustafar, he suffered multiple third degree burns all throughout his entire body. This led to his flesh having to be replaced with a synthetic gel. This type of gel was the same material that Luke had around his hand in The Empire Strikes Back. So not only would the needles need to be injected into him, but the new artificial skin that he would have would make him itch constantly. Sounds like a lot, right? Well, this is probably where you ask the question, how was Vader even able to sleep under these conditions? Well, he rarely ever slept. Because of the itching and the constant pain, it was rare that Vader ever had the chance to sleep. He was always suffering. So because of this, this is where his back to tank and his meditation chamber would come into place. He couldn't really sleep in his back to tank, but it did allow him to meditate there for a little while, which was somewhat peaceful for him. However, in order to come to a full sleep, he would require his suit. And while it was rare, there was actually a few occasions where he'd be able to take a few naps here and there. But sadly, these naps wouldn't really last long because he'd usually be woken up by haunting nightmares or visions. These visions would normally be about Padme or his former master, Obi-Wan Kenobi. I'll be releasing another video on this soon, but Vader wasn't only consumed by the pain in his suit, but you also have to understand, he also dealt with a lot of emotional pain. Although he was seen as a terrifying Sith Lord, in reality, Vader was filled with depression. He spent a lot of time thinking about the choices he made, which created him to become what he is now, a machine. So you combine that, along with him being sleep deprived for over 20 years, it really must have driven his mental state past the point of insanity. But I want to know from you, if Vader was never burnt and he didn't go through that torture that Sidious put him through in the suit, do you think he still would have had that same strong connection to the dark side? Or do you think it would have been a lot less without it? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. Thanks for watching and may the force be with you, always.